While caught in the middle of a nationwide college admissions cheating scandal, USC has announced a new president. That's right. Dr. Carol Folt will be the university's 12th leader and its first female president. Tonight, Kate Cowan's Chris Holmstrom is here with more about her and her plans going forward. Chris? Yeah, this really is a historic day for USC. Dr. Carol Folt is the former chancellor of the University of North Carolina at Chapel Hill, but she has a few California credits. She attended Santa Barbara City College, UC Santa Barbara, and UC Davis, where she earned a master's in biology and a doctorate in ecology. USC, a school plagued by a series of scandals, from a disgraced medical school dean who did meth with drug dealers on campus to the clinic gynecologist accused of sexually abusing hundreds of women. Scandals that cost former president Max Nikias his job. And now the admissions bribery scandal. No campus more involved than USC. Tonight, Dr. Carol Folt says she is ready to take on these challenges as USC's first female president. But it raises the question. Knowing what you know, mm -hmm. why take this job? Honestly, I'm taking this job exactly because of what I know. Laughter aside, Dr. Folt is no stranger to university challenges, most recently as the chancellor of the University of North Carolina. For years, Foltz attempted to end a divisive controversy in Chapel Hill. What to do with the Confederate statue on campus that offended many but was protected by law? I have a preference to move it off campus, but like everyone here, I swore to obey the law. The issue became national news. Folt tried turning it into a community discussion about race and inclusion. Ultimately, she was forced to resign. Her last act, though? removing the statue off campus. But what is she going to do about USC? I don't have the answers yet. I really don't. But I do think I know a lot about how bringing people together, how you try to take these, you dissect these problems, you look for the things that you can do, and you don't hide for them. You embrace them. Tonight, USC professors are speaking out, including Dan Simon, a professor of law and psychology. We're feeling very good about this uh, development. Um, I believe that this was a very good pick. Professor Simon helped draft a proposal to remove former President Max Nikias. 200 professors supported the move. He says many of them are excited about the new leadership. Folt seems uh, to be uh, intent on delivering a new set of values, but also of governance. She is promising a much more introspective and critical reflection of who we are and whom we should be. Students also speaking out. She handled the Confederate situation uh, in North Carolina pretty well, so I already like what she's done there, and I'm excited to see what she does here. I'm very happy that they're taking a new direction. It seems like they've really listened to what we wanted in a leader, and I think she really embodies that. And Dr. Folt will officially take on the role this summer. Back to you.